Okay, here's a curious little fellow that I came up with. It's a little pulse motor being uh, run by a double A battery and a uh, very simple circuit called the Darlington Pair, uh, triggered by a phototransistor. And I'm calling this the Darlington Pair Sunrunner Pulse Motor. And uh, I'm the lid motor, and this is the 25th of October 2014. And you can freeze frame this and look at the circuit. It's really, really simple. And uh, I'm calling this the Sunrunner because it's being triggered by indirect ambient sunlight coming through that window. And right now it's about uh, 5 o'clock in the afternoon. That's late afternoon sunlight. And uh, it's uh, allowing this to run. And the way it works is the Darlington pair increases your sensitivity. And basically you have three NPN type of transistors linked up in such a way that when the base basically of this first one here is tickled by the light photons, it sets up this cascade effect which finally flips the switch, which makes the circuit for the coil work and causes the rotor to move around till the next magnet comes up, reflects the sunlight, tickles the base of that, off it goes again. And it's really, really simple. These are uh, 2N4401s. Uh, any of your standard little um, NPN transistors, you can get them at the Radio Shack uh, work. This is actually a Radio Shack photo transistor. And I wanted to use that because I wanted people to be able to get, uh, find it. Uh, Radio Shack has that transistor, that photo transistor. A lot of them will work. But uh, very interesting little, uh, little device. And one of the things that I did to make it work better was I put a little uh, tube around the photo transistor to isolate the phototransistor from the other sunlight. And then on the rotor, I put black tape between the magnets so that it basically gave a better response as the light hit that shiny magnet and reflected back to the phototransistor. And uh, this is probably the most critical thing right here is you absolutely would have to have a very, very low friction rotor system for this to work. Without that, of course, she's not going to work. But that's pretty neat. That's a, a sewing bobbin uh, filled up with 30-gauge uh, magnet wire. It measures about...